Hey, Clayton Bates here from Inspire Small Business, and today I'm going to do a review on Dubutify. So a little bit about me, I'm actually a Shopify partner and I build websites and stuff like that. And I thought it would be cool to actually make this new channel and just do some reviews and some tips and how-to videos and stuff like that. So let's actually get into it. Now, Dubutify advertises their theme as the number one free Shopify theme. Now, is it really the number one Shopify three free theme? Well, we're going to find out today. So I'm going to actually talk about some of the things I like about it, some of the things I don't like about it, um, how it can actually help you, and the type of people this theme is actually for. So if we're on Jubutify's website here, so like I was saying, they advertise it as the number one free Shopify theme. Now, if you actually scroll down, at the moment, 7,804 people have actually downloaded Jubutify. Um, I think when I first found out about this website, they were at about 3,000 maybe. And over the last few months, I've actually implemented this theme into about 30 um, stores that I've actually built. Now, if we actually go to their demo store, um, one thing about their demo store, I apologize, Jubutify, but I really don't like your demo store because I don't think it actually displays just how good this theme actually is. So we'll actually have a look. Now, it's got a lot of the normal things that you'll see on, on themes, like collection lists, um, slideshows, all that sort of stuff. And if, if you go into the back end sort of thing, this is like my test sort of website. These are all the things you can actually add to the, the home page. So like blog posts, um, collection list, featured collections, gallery, image with text, logo list, featured product, newsletter, map, featured content, testimonials, text columns with images, videos, custom HTML. And the other cool thing is they have this little guarantee thing that you can actually do. So that's pretty much the, the stuff that the home page can add. Um, while we're here, may as well talk about the footer. I actually love their footer. Um, a lot of free themes and that, they don't have much options to customize the footer. And personally, when I build websites, the main menu, the drawer menu, the footer menu, um, I always make them so they can get pretty much anywhere on your website in one or two clicks. And Dubutify's footer actually is awesome to do that. Now, just before we actually get into like one of the products, um, so while this theme is actually free, um, they have this like add-ons that you can add to your website for a few dollars a month sort of thing. So I'll actually explain how that works in a minute. Um, just one other thing I actually really like about Jubutify. If you actually go in to the colors of the website, so a lot of the free themes, you actually can't customize the colors very well on the, on the free themes. Because there's not very much options for that. And Jubutify has lots and lots of options to customize your color so if you can sort of see down here that's a lot more customization than a lot of the free themes that's actually more customization than some of the paid themes i think some of the paid themes need to work on that customization of the colors um, so that's actually really good about jubitify because you you really want to like customize your website and make it look good especially the colors and stuff like that now these add-ons that I was talking about. So the good thing about this theme is if you want a better theme than the Shopify ones for free and you don't have much money, it's great to download this theme into your website. And if if you don't have that money to spend on actually buying like a $180, $200 theme, um, Jubitify actually has a monthly plan where you can, for like five bucks a month, you can actually add add things to your website to make it, um, just look that little bit better. So it's a really good option if you don't want to um, outlay all that money straight up, especially if you don't know if your store is actually going to work or not. So how that actually works is these are the plans I actually have. So like for $5 a month, you can add three of their add-ons and for 20, you can add all of them. Um, 13, you can add seven. Personally, the $20 one, probably don't need this at the moment, the $5 one's a pretty good start. And what you can actually add is down here. So they've got 
add to cart animation. I actually haven't used that one yet. Um, frequently asked questions. You can actually build out a really good frequently asked questions page. Um, newsletter pop up. Um, that's really good. Um, shop protection. That's just a new one. So I haven't actually played around with that one yet, but I'm assuming that would be pretty good. Um, sticky add to cart. So when people scroll down your product description and they go past the add to cart button, um, it'll just stick to the top of the page and follow them down. That's awesome. Um, product tabs, I really like those. So at the bottom of your product description, you can actually have tabs. So you could put one for like shipping information or just whatever refund policy. So people can actually just tab on it and it will open up your policy just so they don't have to go to your policy pages. So that's really good. You can add anything into that really. Um, Instagram feed, that's awesome. Especially if your business focuses a lot on Instagram. Um, chat box, you know, pretty standard that one. Cookie box, pretty standard too. Um, live view, that's actually awesome. Under your product title, it'll just display how many people are actually viewing your store, which is good. Um, product video, I really like this one. Um, so instead of your product images, you can actually add videos as well. Um, that's really cool. Personally, for me, I like to add just the images there. And then in the description, I chuck in videos and stuff like that. Um, their trust badges. I think this is the best one I've ever seen um, on anything because it really in integrates into their website very well. And you can actually like upload any image in there. You don't have to do any coding or anything. It just, it's really simple. Um, sales pop, so it will display like a notification in the bottom left-hand corner, just telling you, telling the visitors like when someone bought something, how long ago, stuff like that. That can really help. Um, their mega menu, that's only new. That's actually pretty good. And delivery time. So if you have really fast delivery times, this is awesome. It just goes straight under the product title and people can see how quickly they're going to get it. So let's go back to their demo store and actually go to a product, some products. So this is like pretty much the layout. Um, that's the delivery time there. That's a pretty good one. Um, the viewers there. Um, their trust badge here. I actually don't like how they've done this. This is just a generic one they've put in there. Um, you can you can really put a really good image into there and it makes it look good. And you can actually put, make it so it's a color around the box as well, which is good. Um, some product tabs there. You know, it looks it looks pretty good. Like I was saying before, I think they could have built this page out a lot better. Um, you can display testimonials here. You can add the a review app, things like that. That's that Instagram one that I was talking about. That's actually pretty cool. So overall, it's pretty good. Like I, like I was saying, if you're just starting out, this is probably the perfect theme for you sort of thing. And if you don't have much money to spare, I'll definitely go to Beautify, test it out for a little, um, even maybe add that $5 add-on and take advantage of the three add-ons. And the ones I really like is like delivery time, um, product tabs, trust badges. I really love that one. Um, things like that, you know, can really help the conversions. And realistically, if if you're going to use a Shopify free theme, you may as well try to beautify because it's just so much better. I, I personally just love to beautify. Um, like I was saying, is it the best theme ever? No, like every, every theme has a flaw, some sort of thing that something on this, every theme doesn't work for everyone. And you know, do beautify isn't perfect, but it's a, so much better than those Shopify free themes. And it can really help you out. So if you're just starting out, I'll definitely just download your Beautify. And if you ever have any questions, their support is absolute awesome. Like, I don't know how many times I've actually messaged your Beautify and they've just got back to me like straight away. And 
yeah, it's, their support is just awesome. And you think for a free team, like, and you're getting support like that, it's just, that's so great. Um, so thanks to Beautify for that. And yeah, so that's my review. I hope you liked it. Um, if you, I've actually got a free website checklist that tells you like 16 steps you need to implement into your website. You can actually download that below. Um, and if you want a store review of your actual website, I do like free video reviews. And um, if you want me to do one of them for you, just in the description, there'll be a link to that. And I'll just, I'll shoot you one. And, you know, another set of eyes on your store really helps. So hopefully you liked all this and I'll speak to you soon. Bye.